first reading what is sown is perishable and what is raised is imperishable a reading from the first letter of st paul to corinthians chapter 15 verses 35 to 37 and verses 42 to 49 someone will ask how are the dead raised with what kind of body do they come you foolish man what you sow does not come to life unless it dies and what you sow is not the body which is to be but a bare kernel perhaps of wheat or of some other grain so it is with the resurrection of the dead what is sown is perishable what is raised is imperishable it is sown in dishonor it is raised in power it is sown a physical body it is raised a spiritual body if there is a physical body there is also a spiritual body thus it is written the first man adam became a living being the last adam became a life giving spirit but it is not the spiritual which is first but the physical and then the spiritual the first man was from the earth a man of dust the second man is from heaven has was the man of dust so are those who are of the dust and has is the man of heaven so are those who are of heaven just as we have borne the image of the man of dust we shall also bear the image of the man of heaven the word of the lord thanks be to god responsorial psalm let our response be i shall walk in the presence of god in the light of the living my foes will be put to flight on the day that i call to you this i know that god is on my side let our response be i shall walk in the presence of god in the light of the living in god whose word i praise in the lord whose word i praise in god i trust i shall not fear what can mortal man do to me let our response be i shall walk in the presence of god in the light of the living i am bound by the vows i have made you o god i will offer you praise for you rescued my soul from death you kept my feet from stumbling that i may walk in the presence of god in the light of the living let our response be i shall walk in the presence of god in the light of the living gospel reading the seed in the good soil are those who hold fast the word and bring forth fruit with patience a reading from the holy gospel according to st luke chapter 8 verses 4 to 15 when a great crowd came together and people from town after town came to jesus he said in a parable a sower went out to sow his seed and as he sowed some fell along the paths and was trodden under foot and the birds of the air devoured it and some fell on the rock and as it grew up it withered away because it had no moisture and some fell among thorns and the thorns grew with it and choked it and some fell into good soil and grew and yielded a hundredfold as he said this he called out he who has ears to hear let him hear and when his disciples asked him 
what this parable meant jesus said to you it has been given to know the secrets of the kingdom of god but for others they are in parables so that seeing they may not see and hearing they may not understand now the parable is this the seed is the word of god the one along the path are those who have heard then the devil comes and takes away the word from their hearts that they may not believe and be saved and the ones on the rock are those who when they hear the word receive it with joy but because they have no root they believe for a while and in a time of temptation fall away and as for what fell among the thorns they are those who hear but as they go on their way they are choked by the cares and riches and pleasures of life and their fruit does not mature and as for that in the good soil they are those who hearing the word hold it fast in an honest and good heart and bring forth fruit with patience the gospel of the lord praise be to god